Alright, I've got some more panels. I've added some more to uh, the roof. It's another row I got really, really cheap. So you've got those ones. Got the original ones. Back four more in there, under there. Plus all the ones over on that side of the roof. Right over there. This is a new set that I've just put in. I've got these cheap. Hopefully they're going to be good. There's a bit of... Um, a bit hard to tell us. don't know if you can see it or not. but There's a bit of like water sweating inside the panel. So the seat next to the... Just there. So I hope these will be alright. I'm going to let them dry out before I hook them all up. Just leave them up here for a day or so. All the wires are all out on the backs there, waiting to be um, strung together. I've got a proper aero sharp inverter to run these ones so I can keep it um, a bit better than um, using those Chinese ones. I've had a couple of those fail again, so I'm getting off those things there. Not very reliable, so. But this should work out to be about 1.2 more kilowatts once it all works out. I'd expect to only get 1,000 watts. I only get, that's supposed to be a 1.5 up the top there. And that only puts out about 1100 to 1200 at best. Um, yeah, and all the other stuff, all those other panels there, I get about seven, eight hundred watts on a good day, an hour, or max. So it's pretty good, but they've all got little watermarks on them. So I'm hoping they're going to be good still. And then I'll, um, I'll hook these up and I'll do another video, see how they perform. Catch us later.